So just starting from side control, um, and I was showing you guys this today. If I have this frame and I bridge out, I can bring this knee in really easily, and then this one swivels in, and I'm back to shin guard, also known as L guard. And then from here, I have the shin sweep. We've all done. But what if he brings his arm to the inside? This one. We have that arm bar. We've done that. But the other place that this sets us up for is put your knee back down. Is I'm going for this and I can't get it. And I go around to here. And then this is what I consider side guard because I'm on the side. So from here, I have options to go for a triangle or the arm or the leg. His only option is to grab up onto this leg and pull it off and get back to this position. That's his only. Or pass. The problem though is if he starts trying to pass, I have the same sweep as the L sweep, but it's from that side guard, so it's the side guard sweep. So again, I'm here. I bring this over, clamp it down. And now from right here, if I hold on to this, and he tries reaching up and grabbing on and pulling this leg off. He's not going to be very successful. He's just going to end up getting himself swept because he puts his head down on the mat. And then there's the sweep. So now from right here, I can reach back and get the Kimura. He's going to straighten his arm likely because he doesn't want to get Kimura. I have a straight arm lock. Or he's going to bring his hand in front. And this one is just vicious. The Americana. This one I can go. Boom, and take it the whole way, which is just nasty. So that's one aspect of it. The other aspect is through to the reverse triangle right here. And then same thing, I have all of these same submissions whenever I want them. And I also have reverse triangle, and then ironically I still have the sweep. And now from the sweep, now I can do the same thing. Right here, like I said, I can do all my uh, Kimuras, arm bars, Americanas from right there. So, from this end, you can go right here. Sure, it's off in side control. I make my frame, I bridge up, I bring that knee in, I swivel the other knee in. Now I'm in shin guard, I have the sweep, bring this leg through, and then now I'm in side guard. Kimura. Arm bar, Americana. I can hold on to this, I can reach through to the triangle, get all the same, or the triangle, or the triangle sweep. And the last place that I mentioned, some people will just hug this leg right here. Um, actually, there's one more. So, from right here, this is something I think I started doing this at Blue Belt in tournaments and getting it successfully. Going to here and sitting out to that. Um, I showed it to De La Hiva at one of the seminars. By the way, he was in the corner for Anderson Silva last night, which is pretty cool. Showed it to De La Hiva. Comes over and he goes, beautiful, beautiful. And I'm like, so have you, have you ever, have you seen that, sir? It's like, beautiful, beautiful. Like, cool. I feel really awesome. And then I realized he's going around to everybody and he's going, beautiful, beautiful. And that was the only word he knew in English at that time. <laughs> so I was like, oh, I thought I was doing really good. Um, but anyways, it's like an inverted omoplata. So this would be the omoplata. To not get omoplata, he re reaches around here. I bring this through. So it's kind of like an inverted omoplata. When I was hitting it, we were jokingly calling it the ruin plata. So then the other place off of the side guard, if he is holding on to here, I can't get it. I go right back to the foot and I get my toe hold. What happens sometimes is that he uh, starts thinking about rolling out of this and going that way. Yeah. So as soon as he goes up and starts rolling that way, I switch this to a knee bar. And I get the knee bar and go back to the toe hold. Whatever I want from there. Side guard. <laughs> 